Hey guys, it's Dan from DisneyInfinityCodes.com and I am here inside Disney Infinity 3.0 with none other than Yoda to explore the Galactic Hall of Heroes. Yeah! Um, this is awesome. It's great to see the originality that they come up with. It was super cool when 2.0 came out and we've got the Helicarrier as the Hall of Superheroes for all the Marvel characters. And um, I was thinking to myself... Uh, all the way up through the announcements of 3.0, occasionally I would think, what are they going to do with Mar with a Star Wars uh, Hall of Heroes, and what are they going to call it? And so, of course, you can access it by um, going to the load menu, and it is the Hall of Galactic Heroes. Um, and I kept thinking, what what are they going to do? Maybe like um, maybe do like uh, like a hangar inside the Death Star. Um, maybe they do something silly like the trash compactor or uh perhaps they do something weird like um like endor and the um you know in the ewok city uh but um never did, i didn't think that they would do uh the honestly, honestly i was thinking they would do the my top pick though was the jedi council the, the big round jedi council i thought that would have been the obvious choice um but i think this is this is clever uh for two reasons i love that they're calling back to the original star wars film perfect um a lot of people had problems with the uh the the prequel trilogy um and uh the fan base still loves the original trilogy of star wars and so to bake to bake this in as the hall of heroes um the hall of galactic heroes for the star wars characters is perfect it's smart it's 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 great um and uh and then on top of which um it's also just clever it's smart because this is the the award ceremony this is uh you know this is the acknowledging the heroes this is the one of the big moments of the uh the star wars franchises you know you did something great everyone's going to gather together and we're going to award you know we're going to you know award you so um so anyway here we go we're going to take a look uh, and of course i've got yoda who else would i pick you know um uh, and so we've got pedestals everywhere oh and I don't, I mean, it goes without saying, I think, if you're a Star Wars fan, but this is the uh, the temple um, that uh, was then retrofitted by the Rebel Alliance as a base on uh, Yavin 4, I believe, Yavin 4. So um, got, got a few pilots here lining the way. Uh, I can pick them up and I can throw them. Um, okay, so uh, right as I walk in, you've got, take a look around here real quick. Man, this is really cool. Uh, so uh, really, really fun, awesome kind of, uh, sorry, I'm just, I, I always love, you know, making sure everyone's posed just right for like that good, like screenshot kind of thing. Um, ooh, and now you're hearing me do the screenshots. Sorry about that. So uh, when you first walk in, you've got these pedestals here. So we'll just kind of wander around the room and take a look at what we've got. So let's check it out. Darth Vader, of course. I have a feeling these are going to be the bad guys right here. Yep, Boba Fett. And Darth Maul. There are there are current three villain characters. Uh, and I have a strong feeling we might see... Maybe we're going to get three more villains. You know, they like to... Disney likes to keep... You know, Disney Infinity like, like to keep everything symmetrical. They like to keep everything balanced. So uh, that'll be fun to see. Um, we got this little pocket up here. There's four of them. Let me guess. Rebels? Yep. Rebel time. Uh, we got Zeb. We've got Kanan. We've got Ezra. And we've got Sabine. It's interesting that uh, they chose to use their full names on the packaging and, and uh, in big announcements, but they, uh, they did not use their full names uh, on here. And we've got this little... I wonder what that little blue thing is up there. Do you see it? Um, well, JV did mention that uh, these uh, areas would grow as uh, figures and things were announced and uh, and you know debuted. So um, it's interesting, and I wonder if maybe like these little corridors here will get deeper, or they'll open up to some alternate areas to run around and explore inside here. So uh, let's run across here. We've got four here. What do we think is going to be in here? I'm thinking Twilight of the Republic characters. Let's see. Oh, 
Oh, yep. Yeah. We got Obi Wan. We've got Anakin. We've got Ahsoka. And Yoda, the one and only. Um, and then uh, what I really, really like, uh, and I already, if those of you who know the, the current lineup, you'll know who's up here on these uh, four pedestals. And I think this is super clever because uh, in this scene in the film, if you remember, these four characters are the ones that are up on the uh, up on the top of the stage, up on the, the, the you know, the, the, the altar, if you will, of this temple. Uh, these four characters are the ones that are in the film on, on, the, on the altar being presented awards. And I think that's very, very clever that they decided to do this. Uh, Chewbacca, Luke, Han Solo, and Princess Leia. Cool, uh, and so we've got power discs, of course. Your little power disc section. So, Galactic Team Up, Mace Windu. Skies over Felucia. Uh, Forest of Felucia. Apologies, you probably can hear my neighbor mowing his grass. That's just what you're gonna get, you know? Um, General Grievous' wheel bike. The Slave One Flyer. Oh, it's interesting that they uh, it's called the Slave One Flyer because uh, every everything that they say we've been hearing on Toy Box Summit, they've just been calling the Slave One. So uh, the Y Wing Fighter, Princess Leia's Boosh disguise, and Luke's Rebel Alliance flight suit costume. Now you can kind of see here that I'm getting the feeling that we might have space for maybe two more power discs here. Um, maybe we could squeeze in one more power disc here and one more power disc here. So I'm thinking, guys, that we might be seeing a Force Awakens power disc pack at the very least um, because there are there's definitely room for four more power discs uh, in here. Uh, and then we've got these things. Uh, interesting little buttons. And uh, I haven't really... We haven't been playing. We haven't... Uh, un Put all the characters on the base yet so we'll have to come back and see what it looks like when everything is all filled out and uh, what these guys do because this will be interesting there's uh you've got of course the four uh uh you got the three red buttons over here and six blue buttons over here so uh, that'll be interesting to find out what that is but uh but there you go guys thanks for watching and of course Visit us at DisneyInfinityCodes.com every week, weekly giveaways, uh, and we also pull together the best deals across the board for you to check out and save, save, save. So um, Disney Infinity, ooh, look at Yoda, he's doing some stack attacks. Look at that, I love it. Um, but thanks for watching, uh, please subscribe. We love all of our subscribers and leave a comment because I love reading the comments and then commenting back. It's one of my favorite things. So leave a comment. Maybe tell me who your favorite Star Wars character is or what Star Wars character you want to see in here or talk about how uh, tasteful the ivy is that's growing up these pillars that are right behind Yoda's head right now. I don't care. Talk to me. Let's talk. Let's chat. Let's do it. Um, but thanks for watching, guys.